The internet's kind of buzzing with the yeah. randoms thing right now. Tiny has written a, well, I shouldn't even say written, he's voiced an audio book. How do you feel about that one? Um, I feel like um, looking at it as a businessman and what he's doing without my emotional emotional attachments to it mm-hmm. and the stuff he's talking about on it because we're from the hood, we're connecting it. But looking at it as a businessman, um, I think it's really good. I think his book's really good. It's put um, together quite well, don't you think? Yeah, the narration yeah, yeah, is good. Yeah, yeah, and, um, yeah. It's the first of its kind. Have you ever heard of a, um, a hood audio book? Yeah, yeah 100%. I haven't before. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, and a, lot, a lot of sorry, people, sorry, sorry, a lot of people talk about doing things, and don't but they don't do, do it. Yes, Puff. There's no budget with that book. There's no nothing. The man's trying to do a thing. You know, how you feel That's emotionally? Tough. Emotionally, <laughs> he's talking. He's saying. <laughs> he picks you up, though. Um, he emotionally, he's saying some stuff on there. Like he's fabricating a lot of stuff. Yeah, and hundred. To 100. be fair, he's probably doing that to formulate the hype. What is is it's formulating? Yeah, what it's generating. And yeah. he's violating a couple of the man them on the block, which are, you know I he's don't not, stand for. Come on, one hundred. But at the end of the day, like you know, like without anyone's emotions attached to it, the man's selling a book. He could be out there trying to be a, uh, um, still trying to be a gangster. He's mm-hmm. selling a book. He's telling a story. Let him be. Yeah, let him be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad boy audio books. Yeah. Yeah, all right, you see the narrator? I was going to ask this question. Do you think the narrator should be getting stick? I'm every man talking about the narrator deserve to get cut up. Because it's a white boy. I hear that, but he's doing a job. He's got a job. To, maybe a mad, that's, maybe that's, a mad man people has given... Up, people don't want no, to cut up yeah. Listen, people don't want to cut A madman's given him, a, it, a, mad maybe, man's given maybe, him yeah. a script, yeah? yeah. A madman's given him a script and said, Eh, hey, what? Read that. At the end of the day, at <laughs> yeah, the end of what the day, do you do? Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's a script. People are talking about it. Yeah, hundred. Whoever narrated it or whatever. Yeah, but the only reason why I say that is because of the it. word nigger and stuff like that. Do you I understand? I say my music, yeah, and I say nigger in my music, yeah, and if some white fan wants to see I, my music and I say nigger, that. I don't give a fuck. Makes all the sense because I don't mean it in that and context. You put it out if they sing along with that, when I say nigger, I'm talking about my brothers or my black brothers. Mm-hmm. So. It's, it's said with love. Yeah, yeah. you're not yeah, saying yeah, it. Yeah. You're not saying it with malicious intent. And obviously, you can't say it. And then obviously, expect- like we, we, you know, our black culture where we stand by that stuff and we don't let it happen. Like we don't let white people say nigger or whatever. But you 100%. know, like it's not that deep. You know what I mean? Because yeah. we're, we're saying it, isn't it? Hundred percent. Definitely. One hundred percent. And like I said, actors don't get stick. When when the actor plays a racist white man, people don't want to kill him. So why they want to kill the narrator? Definitely, I rate the, I rate the book. I rate the book highly. Still, it, <laughs> it don't it, make it, no sense. It allows you to lay why on your good back. Chat? It's a good chat. It allows you, you to. What? Uh, oh, sorry, go on, go on. I'm saying it allows you to lay on your back and close your eyes and vision. You can vision what my man's saying is very ill with these words. You get me? So that, yeah, I have to big him up for that book. One hundred. How you feel about Delpy's response? Um, Delpy's response. Um you know that like, Delpy should just concentrate on his book what he's got and put get that out you know and get that rolling mm. we're talking you know, about him though I try to stay away from the mix up thing you get me 100 he's got a dope book I've seen the script you know and he should concentrate on that and try and get that out you know Tiny's actually come out and working uh, yeah, well, yeah, I don't yeah, know yeah. if he's out or whatever but he's working and get out Delpy should get his script out because his script yeah. is cold 100% mm. he has got some points as what he's saying Tiny wasn't the founder of the ghetto boys couldn't have been there's a few other points or whatever but like I'm just not into the, the whole mix, mix up, up thing. Yeah. 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 everyone yeah. should just crack on yep yeah. 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 and if you've got a story to tell yeah, put out your story. side of it look Delpy was was a ghetto boy, a ghetto man. He is a G. Foundation. No matter what everyone says about him, he's a bad boy. I know that personally. Tiny was a bad man. Hundred percent. You know, like um, maybe he 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 ended up being an enemy of ghetto boys or whatever. But he was a bad man, and he's from ghetto. Mm-hmm. They're entitled to tell their stories. You got other people that are telling stories that was never a part of mm-hmm. nothing. We gonna get on to that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> we we gonna get on to that. Right we gonna get 100%. on to that. Buck and Nicky Ford founded TGB. Founded okay, okay, okay. okay. Yes, 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 yes. Like, but, And then um, yes, you know, yes, yes, YGB yes. was Sparks, Box, TQ, Delpy, Delpy Hotters. Hotters. You get me? Yes. So Doc and Nicky Ford founded TGB. You, you see it yeah. So you've made the people they know. Yeah. People they mean asking what? questions. Let me ask you people always ask me this, Cole. 